make the Starbucks slime is some glue. It can be Elmer School glue or glue all. I'm just using glue all. You're going to be needing some brown food coloring, a spoon and a bowl to mix with, some Daiso clay or any type of soft clay you like. I just prefer Daiso clay. Some activator, which mine is just one teaspoon of borax powder mixed with one cup of hot water. And then the last thing you're gonna be needing is obviously a Starbucks cup. So let's get started. First, we're going to make our slime. You wanna start off with the all white plain glue base. So you wanna add a lot to fill up your Starbucks cup. So I'm gonna make about that much. And now, we're going to activate it. I'm just using about one and a half cups of glue. Okay guys, so my slime is done and I did leave it a little bit sticky just so the dice of clay would, you know, blend in good and stuff. So yeah, but it's super thick and glossy. And now I'm gonna add the dice of clay. And don't add your food coloring yet because we are gonna have to save a little bit to be like the whipped cream. So. Well, first I'm gonna take a little bit out to be like the chocolate drizzle. So we have to take a little bit out. And that we're not gonna add Dice Clay too because then it'll be too thick. So I'm gonna add a whole pack of Dice Clay. Mixing. I think they're really satisfying. So yeah, now it's pretty much blended in. I'm gonna need it a little bit more just to get all of the little chunks blended in. And also guys, I forgot to mention, but the Starbucks cup was free. You can just go to Starbucks and ask for a plain cup with a lid. I'm going to open my Starbucks cup and fill it up to the brim because that'll be the coffee part, obviously. And then the extra will be the whip. So I'm going to fill it up. I think I might have made a little too much, but that is fine. Okay, so that is probably good for like the coffee part. And then the excess I have will be just for the um, whipped cream. So yeah, but now you want to color your, um, like this part, brown, to be like the coffee. Now mine is gonna be really light because the Frappuccino I always get is called the double, double chocolate Frappuccino and that's like really light. I'll insert a picture right here. So yeah, but that is really light. So I'm just gonna make it really light. And then I also need to figure out what I'm gonna use for the chocolate chip, chocolate chips, because it has like little pieces of chocolate in it. So I think I might just cut up um, some rubber bands. I don't know. Okay, yet. so I'm gonna take my brown food coloring. Just add a little bit, not too much. That might be good, I might have to add more. But you always wanna start off with a little bit because if you add too much, then you can't really take it away. Okay, yeah, that is not enough, guys. I need to add a lot more. Let's compare it. Okay, it looks really red, so I think I'm going to... Well, I don't know, actually. That actually looks pretty similar. Okay, I think we're good now. Fine glitter. And if you have, like, the chunky black glitter, you should totally use that, because that would probably work a little better. But this is all I have right now, so we're going to go with it. All right, I think that looks pretty nice. So now I'm going to just put it in my Starbucks cup. Okay. 
fill it all the way to the rim. That's probably good. So I do have a little bit of extra left, but that's fine, because, I mean, hey, you have a lot saved for later. I mean, that, that's awesome. <laughs> so now what I'm going to do, it has like a lot of the black stuff at the top. So I think I'm gonna add a little bit more glitter on the top. So I'm kind of just gonna add a tiny bit here and there to kind of make it look a little more realistic. Cause you know, I'm trying to get it to be pretty realistic to the real thing. I keep saying real and realistic, I'm so sorry. Looking good to me. All right, so now I'm gonna let that sit. I'm going to take the plain slime without the clay in it and make like the chocolate drizzle. So the chocolate drizzle is really dark, so I'm gonna add quite a lot of brown food coloring. And I would just use plain food coloring, but that would be really messy, so I don't want to do that. Ah, oh, my fingers are getting so messy. All right, so I have it done. I did leave it a little bit sticky just so it'll drizzle on pretty easy. And now time for the fun part, assembling it. So I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm going to take some white. I don't really know how much white I need. I'm gonna like take as much as I need to fill this up, probably. It's probably good right there. All right, so now I'm going to Oh, really carefully swirl it. I'm so scared. I probably should have activated this a little bit more, but it's fine. I'm scared. I'm going to mess this all up. Okay. Going to put the drizzle on really quick. Ah, oh, that looks terrible. You know, it, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to put the cap on. Okay, that, that, that's okay, that looks decent. All right, I did drip the drizzle a little bit, but that's fine. And I am gonna take off that extra at the top. Oh, fun, that's so cool. Okay, so now I'm just going to stick a little straw in. Okay, so I have the straw and I'm going to plop it in. Oh my God, it looks so cool. Again, not as similar but I'm gonna go try and prank some people. I'm gonna prank my dad. I hope he falls for it. Hey, would you like some Starbucks? I made some Starbucks. Oh, looks pretty good. What flavor is this? A double chocolate frappuccino. It's not working too good. Touch it. <laughs> it's slime. Nice. Hey, mommy. Um, I made Starbucks. You, would you like some? You made this? Yeah. Like I blended it up and stuff. That looks good. Okay. I, I don't really love whipped cream. It's low fat, right? Yeah. Okay. The heck? What is this? What do you mean? It won't come up in the straw. Let me see. Let me see. What the? What the? What? Girl. <laughs> Come on. Okay, guys. So, I pranked my parents, and they fell for it both, which is pretty funny.